Yo, what's up guys? It's John. Uh, it's Saturday. It's 2 in the morning. Uh, I just got home from a local bar in my town. Uh, went and they went over there and they played some live music tonight. I had a good time while I was rolling on the original LU Dubs right here. Uh, I took two and I'm still rolling bass. Um, but why I'm coming out with this, I'm coming out with a video that I wanted to come out with during the week on, uh, on a research chemical that I tried earlier this week, but I was kind of busy all week, so I didn't get the chance to do it. But now, um, it's two in the morning and I don't even know when I'm going to be falling asleep because I'm still fucking rolling face. So figured I'd do a video on it right now since I have the time and I got nothing else to do and I'm, there's no chance I'm going to sleep now. So, um... Anyway, so on Tuesday, when I get home from work, anyway, um, there's a package in the mail like that I didn't order, and open it up, and there's a free sample of a research chemical. I really don't know where this came from or anything, but uh, the chemical was said 4-FMC, which is 4-fluoromethcathinone, and before I tried it, I looked it up online, and it's supposedly like similar to mephedrone, but in my experience... I mean, like, I really didn't like 4-FMC when I tried it that much. Like, when I tried it, I snorted a 100 milligram line. Um, see, I, I don't know, I thought it was going to be good because I liked Mephedrone a lot, but this wasn't as good. It was not nearly as euphoric as Mephedrone. Um, it also felt kind of toxic. Like towards the end, like I, I, like later on, I did another hundred milligram line when I started coming down. But towards the end of my trip, it was like, it was like two in the morning, and I could not fall asleep. And I was, go and then all of a sudden, my head started like pounding. I had the worst headache like ever. It was like so unpleasant. I was just like rolling in my bed, like, oh, this sucks, because my head hurt like just so bad. Um, the effects are not nearly as euphoric as methadone. Also, it made me feel very, like, wired and tweaked out. Like, not in a good way. Like, like it, it was just very uncomfortable for me. Like, I, I did not like for fluoromethcathinone that much. I like, like, mephedrone and 4-MEC were much better. Like, I, I wouldn't recommend trying 4-fluoromethcathinone. Um... I mean, this is my own personal experience with it. I don't know how other people's is. Like, other people might have had a different experience and liked it. But to me, it just wasn't worth it. I mean, I got it for free, so I didn't I didn't waste any money on it. And I probably will never buy it. Um, well, I'm rolling so hard right now, yeah. It feels so good. Um, but, yeah. Well, well I'm kind of zoned out. Hold on. But yeah, um, with each dose, the trip lasted about, I mean, like, the, the euphoric effects faded, like, for me, like, pretty quick. It didn't last long enough, but, and then after the euphoric effect, euphoric effect wore off or whatever, um, I still felt, like, wired and, like, tweaked out, like, but without euphoria for, like, a, for, like, hours after that, like, and that sucked, like, what's the point of feeling, like, stimulated and, like, tweaked out, but you have no euphoria, that, that's pointless, um, and, like, I also, like, had a pretty, er, pretty significant urge to do more after the euphoric effects wore off, um, but I would describe the effects as similar to methadrone, kind of like a cross between coke and ecstasy, it's like, like, stimulant, like, like, euphoria with, uh, I would say like mild ecstasy like effects like it's more stimulant than it is like ecstasy there's some like mild like pleasurable rushing type of thing a little bit of sensations but it was mostly just stimulant for me um with a tad of like an ecstasy like feel but uh to me it really wasn't worth it um yeah so fucked up but yeah, so that's my review on 4-fluoromethcathinone. I really didn't like it. I didn't think it was worth it. But uh, I'm not saying that you shouldn't try it. It might be good for you. Everyone's experience with the drug is 
different. Like one person might like it, one person might not. Everyone has different effects from it. So, but just in my own personal experience, I would, I did not like four fluoromethcathinone. I did like four MEC and methadone, but not this. This was like, oh yeah, and that got the next day. I felt like such crap the next day, like all day, and like. Like even like smoking pot like didn't really make me feel any better. Usually like with uh like the like the legal ecstasy pills and stuff like that. Like I usually can smoke pot and like it makes me feel better or whatever. But this like nothing was nothing was making me feel better and I felt like crap all day the next day. And I didn't like I barely got any sleep the, the day I took it. I fell asleep at like five in the morning and then like I automatically woke up at like seven and I was still like so I was stimulated still for some reason and I couldn't I couldn't fall back asleep so I had to get up even though I had like no energy and I hadn't eat, and I hadn't slept and I felt like crap throughout the whole day so my opinion don't try 4-FMC all right guys this is John and I'm rolling bass and I'm probably going to be up the rest of the night it's like 2 15 or so and I had a good time tonight I had a blast with the live music, talking to people, macking on chicks, shit like that. Yeah. Peace out, guys. Stay high.